hey guys welcome back to my channel it's marisa in today's video i am doing my first dollar tree haul of the fall season so let's get started Hey guys, so first let's look at these really, really cool nails I found. Yes, they are very, very fake, but look how cool they are. They're constellations and I love them. So the first thing I got were these gorgeous little velvet, velveteen pumpkins. I've never seen these before with this like really cool golden hook and the stem is really, really pretty and really nice size. It's in the decor section. Yes, they got the fall stuff out already. And that is coming up. That's a little tag. Very, very cool. I got it in two different colors. Really nice and soft. And they're so very pretty. One's golden and one's more orangey. Really, really cute. And that is actually a chalkboard tag. Chalk tag. So, up next, we got a few cool things. I got some beautiful, like, I think this is three or four inch ribbon with that really pretty uh, red truck with the pumpkins in it. And that is actually going to go into Happy Mail, though. It's so pretty. I saw it and I knew exactly who I wanted to give it to. All right. I love that one. All right. And up next, we have some LED lights. These are little pumpkins, and my camera, of course, went out of focus. What else is new? The plastic always makes it go out of focus, but let me take them out of the package real quick. Very, very cute little pumpkins. I love them. I should have gotten more, but I'm going to grab more the next time. Yeah, I was so excited to have all their fall stuff out already, or at least some of it, and they even have Halloween stuff. And guys, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Okay, up next, I found this very, very pretty uh, glue trio, glitter glue. And um, I do not think I have these. I thought I did, but I don't. I actually have like pure orange. And these are in some very, very nice fall colors. Some like coppery red, if I can get it out of the package. Um, all right, we got a silver, and there's the silver, and there's a gold, and here's like a really nice coppery red. Very, very pretty. I may use them like I use my uh, Tonic Studio Nouveau Drops to kind of decorate papers and stuff. So those are really nice, and you get three for a dollar. So let's put those down, and... Up next, um, I got some rub-on stickers. I don't know if I have these, but I may. But these are really pretty, very vintage feeling. I love those. And they work really, really well. Yeah, those are really cool. I don't have a lot of numbers. I have a lot of alphas. And this is a repurchase. I love this one. And every time I see them, I get them again. Because they're like really perfect for all of my vintage projects so that's all they had they only had one so i grabbed it and those are the only stickers i really liked and up next i got some storage containers i've been seeing these for a while and i never picked them up um and i know i can use them for some cool stuff i'm doing some uv resin work and i thought that maybe this would be like good storage for my little um uv jewelry pieces and uh, let's see if I can open this up with the nails. There you go. So I open that up, and it's really cute. And actually, you could put a little magnet on the back. I have these, like, mini magnets um, from the Dollar Tree as well. Oops. Rolling away. Alrighty. So let's move those to the side. And up next, yes, I got this really nice wall hanging. Very, very pretty. It's like this mason jar, and it says, always be thankful, with a little um, rope hook. And the back is just plain, but actually I can embellish it 
with, you know, my Nouveau drops, or I could add maybe some flowers, or, you know, some other kind of stuff, glitter or something, some bling maybe, and I could just kind of, you know, spice it up a bit more, but I really thought that was pretty, and that was new, actually, I never saw that one before. And, yeah, so here are the tags. These are really cool. So that's the one right there. It's a chalkboard tag, and there's six pieces for a dollar. And it also comes with a little um, rope uh, hanging thingy. <laughs> All right, so, yeah, they're very thin, so it is paper. I thought it was, like, uh, a little thicker, but it actually works very well. And I thought it would be a really nice uh, change for tags. And yeah, I could do some maybe paper crafts with it, or I can use them on my paintings. Um, I may be selling some of my paintings over the weekend, so that would be cool to use those as tags. So I thought these were really cute. And you use them for gifts, and I can embellish them, and actually they're actually perfect for Halloween too. So I really like those, even though they're pretty thin, but they actually work very well with the uh, chalk. All right, and then uh, these are little um, clothespin tags, and they're mini uh, chalkboards. So I thought they were adorable, and you get four for a dollar. So again, I thought maybe these we would be good for like price tags, something a little different. And you could just write right on them, and I thought they were really, really cute. Um, I may get more. Uh, depending on how many paintings I bring with me to sell. All right. And, sorry guys, music outside. New York, this is a thick wooden owl. Uh, so I could do a little pour painting on it, possibly, or just do a really nice paint. It's really thick and heavy, and I really love these to uh, pour on. So and I can embellish it and make a little project with that. Okay, so up next, I found this really cool glass. I don't know if this glass are plastic, but I saw a lot of people on some resin groups do these really cool resin uh, projects where they put dried flowers just and they pour the resin right into the glass jar. And I thought that was really, really cool. So I picked one up for a dollar. It's great, even if it doesn't work out, you know. Um, the most expensive thing would actually be the resin. So I really want to try that out. And I also found this really cool glass. Um, I'm actually thinking of maybe doing like a margarita resin piece. Um, so I thought that was a really cool idea. Or I'm just going to give the glass to my son because he loves these types of glasses. So up next, I got these beautiful sunflowers and these other flowers. Really, really pretty. I love the fabric just to decorate a little bit when fall comes very, very soon. And I cannot wait. All right. So I got this really cool sign. Um, I have a little kitchen garden. I'm thinking of putting this outside or, whoops, sorry guys, my camera's shaking. Um, in my uh, plants, it's really, really pretty. I love the pumpkins and that truck again. And then I got all these paints and they're all fall colors. Whoops. As usual, I am always dropping something, but I found three this time, the pouring uh, medium. Last time I went, I did not find it, so I was really happy. I got some Sargent uh, pouring medium, and it's actually not bad. It's not the best medium, but it's actually, you know, I would say it's pretty fair um, pouring medium for my fluid art. All right, let's move that to the side real quick. And I'm going to show you all the colors I got. I got some black and white. And it was really hard to find the black. Last time I did not find any black. So I finally found some black. I'm really happy. And I got two of them. Nope, that's not it. There we go. There's the other black. So they always have white, but it's hard to find the black. So I got two of those. I'm really happy about that. And I got some beautiful browns. 
and I'm thinking of doing like a cafe latte pour. I'm feeling fall already, so this I got this beautiful brown color, and this paint is really great. I have to keep on saying it that that acrology paint is amazing. Acrylic paint for pouring is really awesome for a dollar. You cannot go wrong. So I got these beautiful oranges. Love them. I think they're similar. I don't know if they're exactly the same. In the store, they look slightly different, but they may be the same, but that's fine because I'm going to be using plenty of orange. I think the one on the left is slightly darker, but Acrology is amazing paint. If you have not tried it from the Dollar Tree, please go and check it out because you can use it for any type of painting you do, craft projects and all that. Alrighty. And I got some beautiful, like a very, like a hunter green, very pretty color. And I got like this burnt orange going more on the red side, but it's like not very bright red. So it's really pretty, perfect for fall. And yeah. Oh yeah, that one is a little darker. So we saw those again. So that it it for the paints. So that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed my first fall haul from the Dollar Tree. I'm really, really excited for all my things I got. Always be thankful and I thank you for watching today. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss one of my videos. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.